Let's play a game, Charlie. Like we used to. Like a family. This is actually, I guess, it's called Untitled Luna Game. I don't know. Um, it's the folder it comes in is called Luna is cute, so I'm gonna call it that because I don't want to call it Untitled Luna Platform Game. But it's an Untitled Luna Platform Game. And there's a bunch of music files and an executable. Chapter one: Whale Wars. Nice text effects. Did you get that from PowerPoint? Paul Watts, those darn whalers. That darn quiet music. Suddenly Final Fantasy music. They've got a lot of reinforcements this year. Helicopters, small battleships. What? That seems excessive. I'm gonna surprise them with whatever. What? Something that. The, 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 the. I'm going to try to bring a mystical creature into this world. The only problem is I have no idea. No control over what creature I get. Why do you have this power? Where where did you get this ability? Never mind. It better be something powerful, like a pony. It better be against whaling. Like a lunar pony. Like a pony from space. Or something. I don't recognize this music. Meanwhile, in the distant land of uneven text gradients. Seriously, did your marketing director make the, the text slides in PowerPoint or something? I mean, come on. Ah! What's wrong with your legs? Celestia, did you stop taking your leg twitch medicine again? You need to take that leg twitch medicine, or else you'll, like, die. That's not good. Luna, my dear sister. It's been 100 long years since I really had a chance to talk to you. And I... I'm twitching my legs. Oh god, rainbow portals! Freaking rainbow portals! Always stealing your sister. I hate that. Luna? Great. Now who's gonna distribute the freaking leg twitch pills? And doom music out of nowhere. Where did you go, Luna? Black screen. Luna was transported to a place far away she had never seen before where text gradients and shadowing made text really hard to read. A place called Antarctica. This guy's got some text on his arm, but I can't quite read it. It's like for... something USA? For printing USA? I don't know. Do know where. I bet this is like a watermark on an image he photoshopped this guy out of and he just left it on there. Where am I? Wait, everyone has the same voice. Wait, no wait. Where am I? I'm gonna talk like this. Little pony, I brought you in hopes you could help me. She's not little, she's like... Look at the size of that ship, she's gotta be like... 10 feet tall. What's your name? I'm Princess Luna. How can I help you? I need some whales. I need your help to save some whales from being killed. Is that okay with you? I'd love to help save innocent whales. Good. And what are your powers, then? As my name suggests, I have the power of the moon. So you rise at night, except not actually at night, and you reflect sunlight. That's, that's a terrible power. The moon is a major element of nature. So what a perfect way to show them that nature itself is against whaling. I can't follow that logic. You go ahead and find the Yushins. Yushins. I'll focus on finding the Nishin. I guess these are Japanese whaling ships. Okie! Okay. Suddenly... I don't recognize this music. Whoa. These clouds are very bumpy. Ah! Rockets! What the crap? What? So I shoot frickin'... Oh hey, I can shoot backwards for no apparent reason. So I shoot that, like, Islamic Crescent thing. I don't know what it's called, but... Ah! Whoa. Okay. So we got a platformer with slippery controls and blind jumps. So that's always good. Oh. These are amazingly small platforms. 
and clouds. I mean, I know I'm like a 10 foot tall horse, but still. Actually, more than 10 feet, because that... I don't know. I seem to be giant, considering that ship. I do look cute when I jump, though. Whee! I didn't know horses could jump, like, 60 feet in the air, though. It's gotta be hard on their legs. Man. What? Stop shooting rockets at me! If you saw a frickin' horse walking around on a cloud, would you just think, Hey, let's shoot missiles at that thing. I mean... Who does that? Honestly. Also, what the crap am I collecting? I have no idea what that's supposed to be. Sonic rings? Seriously? Dude, I got through. Is that the Smash Bros sound effect? I have no idea what's going on. Bah! Loud chiptune. Turn that down slightly. Yushin Maru 1. Little pony, little pony. State your business in these waters. Who talks like that? Right, it's enter. You foul harpoon ship. How would you even know that? You're a freaking magical horse from outer space or something. I'm here to put an end to your evil deeds. What evil deeds? Killing whales? That's not evil. Yes, it is. Surrender. Oh, wait. Yes, it is. Surrender, I will have to show you the power of the moon. Are you serious? Shall you try to board this vessel, we'll have to take aggressive action to fend you off. You know, we're also not in the waters, I just realized that. We're in frickin' clouds. What the crap? I can't shoot through clouds, but he can. What? Okay. If I can keep hitting him from here, maybe this isn't so bad. I can't aim my shots, by the way. Well, I can aim the general direction, like left or right, but that's it. Whoa! This is lame. I don't have any other controls I'm aware of. Stop doing that! This is very not fair. I don't even know if my shots are. Oh. There we go. Aha! I'm winning. Ah! Go away! Go away! Go away! No fair. Okay. It's only fair if I shoot you when I can't see you. It's not fair if you shoot me when I can't see you. Go away. Go away. Keep going to the right. Come on. Yeah! We beat the ship. And we got some blue... book... things. Oh, I didn't read that text box. It's too busy watching the magic flying blue books. Luna has sunk Yashinmaru 1. Hooray. Also, that water is kind of choppy. Just a little bit. Um, more blue books. And a helicopter. Bah! Stop shooting rockets in my face. It's very rude. You want to make a bad first impression with someone? Shoot rockets in their face. They will hate you. Like, seriously. I kind of hope I don't have to collect all of these book things, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Even that's kind of awkward, because I have to use weird mid-flight controls. By flight, I mean jump. Okay. Don't recognize this music. I'm sure it swipes from some video game. It's very twinkly, though. I guess that's fitting for being from the moon! Ah! No! Whoa! Just kind of got stuck inside of that cloud. And it saved my life. Okay, there's less blind jumps. There's actually haven't been any blind jumps this level, so... That's good. No matter how, you know, cheaply made your game is, blind jumps are not cool. Let me guess, there's a secret over here. No, there's not. Music fade out. Suddenly different music. Oh. This is just not very good looping. Luna got through Act 2. 
Hey, we almost got a hundred blue books. I don't know what that means. Not the ah. Oh. A duck. Oh wait. Another foul harpoon ship. Tell me why do you kill whales? We read Moby Dick and it was like really freaking awesome, so we're just gonna kill all these whales. I'm pretty sure that's why they do it. Like you expect me to believe that? Whatever. Should you dare to board this vessel, we will say the exact same thing we played last time. We're fighting Dr. Robotnik. And Dr. Robotnik has started using hacks. And also the exact same fight as the last boss. So we shall use the exact same tactic and just sit here. Oh god. It's not working! Okay. Oh. I seem to be hitting that cloud again. Don't you hate it when you're trying to shoot you know, whaling ships with moon lasers, and you just end up shooting a cloud instead. It's one of the most annoying things ever. Stop shooting harpoons at me! Ow. That hurts. You're a jerk. And what's with the, like, sonic rays he's shooting? He could at least be shooting tails rays or something. Ow! Cut it out! Crap. Okay, good. Didn't know where it was going to start me off. I guess if we can continue off where we die, it's not too bad. Though this boss fight is the exact same as the last one. And the last one was really stupid. So, this one remains really stupid. Fortunately, I have a strategy. That strategy is sit in one place and shoot. Working pretty well, I must say. Ah, it's getting near me. Cut it out. No, I wasn't even doing anything to you. I was just sitting here on the freaking clouds. I mean, if you see like a bird in the air, you just kind of like start shooting harpoons at it. Get out of my waters, you're a bird. Goodbye, suckers. Seems very out of character. But oh well. Do I have, like, a giant blue eyelash? Or eyebrow, I mean? I don't know, maybe that's eyeshadow. It just kind of looked like I have the gigantic blue eyebrow, and I'm like, what? And suddenly it's that leak spin music. Ah! Suddenly it's that shooting rockets in my face music. It's my least favorite music ever. They have wildly inappropriate music, but at least it's not bad music. It's all stolen, of course, but... Oh well. No comment. Yeah. Yeah, the game is not nearly as painful as it seemed from my brief... testing attempt. I kind of assumed the whole thing was going to be blind jumps and lameness. Ow. So it's... Why did you put the blind jumps in the first level? That is a great way to discourage people. Your first level is supposed to be the easy one. I mean... People really do do that for a reason. Speaking of easy level... I know I almost died, but that's because I wasn't being very careful at all. Also, that water really bugs me. Let me guess. The exact same thing, number three. I am the exact same thing, number three. How could you kill nature's beautiful creature? Blah. Nature created animals for humans to use as they like. And now I'm a part of nature too, and I say that you're wrong! A little pony will never stop me. Yeah. Gourmet race! Go away, mouse. Ah! Why does it skip like that? It's like, I'm going left, I'm going left, up, oh, my joke, Stand and shoot tactic initiate, oh god. Flee tactic initiate. Resume stand and shoot tactic. You know, you could just not have a boss until the end of, like, the, um, the whatever, the chapter or something. 
and, you know, save us the repetitive crap and just have us fight this one boss once. No! No! Die! So close. Yes! Give me those books. Evil falls again. Now something blah blah blah. Maybe these are cans of whale oil I'm stealing back from them or something, I don't know. I'm going to use the whale oil to clone whales. That makes sense. Yay, we beat Act 1 or something. Or Zone 1. Final Fantasy 8 music. Luna, I think you figured out where Nishin Maru is. Didn't I just kill like three of those? Let's go take him down! For whaling, the end is nigh. Oh, nay. Get it? Ha ha. Boss fight? Books! Give me those books! I said give me those books. They are delicious. Those books or those whale oils or whatever the crap these are. I don't know, I just want them. I guess they make book... They make book kind of sounds. Maybe they're missed books. No idea what this music is. I guess having no idea what's going on isn't really unusual. It's better end soon. These things could at least heal me or something, that would be nice. Also, just like every Luna Sprite in every game I've seen. My hair moves kind of weird. Like, my back hair is separate from my front hair. It's weird. Also, my feet stand on two different planes. Which is odd. See, look at that. My f left feet are, like, on one, and... I guess I'm a horse. I don't have feet, do I? Do horses have feet? I don't think those qualify as feet. Luna, destroying. Wait, I need to give you a new voice. Luna! Destroying harpoon ships and helping Paul Watson makes you an eco-terrorist. No, I'm a kind soul that wants whales to live happily. And I will stop at nothing to get what I want. You won't even stop at, like, killing whales? Because that would be very counterproductive. Tell that to the police. Should you blah blah blah. That last statement really isn't necessary. And let me guess, this is going to be the exact same fight. Called it. Oh wait, no, it's shooting more sonic waves and less harpoons. Not that they seem to be any different at all. Okay, no, it's shooting a lot more of them. No! Ow. This is totally not fair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh god. To do this every time? Okay, I guess it was pretty short. And that's that same You Died screen from one of those Luna games, isn't it? Ugh, I'm so slippery. I guess that's where I get for wearing, like, slippers made out of glass or something. Actually, slippers made out of glass wouldn't be slippery, they would just crunch. Especially if you're a freaking horse. Oh well. I'll try not to think about it. Also try not to think why I'm a freaking horse shooting Islamic symbols out of my horn to destroy whaling ships. Maybe I just should stop thinking and this game will be much more pleasant. Kind of doubt it still. Ah! Not fair. Especially since I can't see how, where I am if I jump, so... Whoa. So close. No! That didn't even hit me. That hit like 10 pixels above my horn. Yeah, yeah, shut up. I need like mega moon lasers or something. That would make this much more fair. There's no mega moon laser button though. No idea what to say because this is really boring right now. 
I mean, the plot isn't really boring. It's completely nonsensical and absurd and makes my brain bleed, but it's not boring. But this fight... Yeah. Uh. It doesn't help that I, you know, I walk around like half an inch after I stop walking. Maybe horses don't stop on dimes very well. Because they probably wouldn't. Stop falling, Luna. It's getting old. Come on. I would call it quits and do another video later, maybe, but I found in test that if I try the chapter select thing after the fact, I have to start the whole chapter again, so... I'm hoping this is the end of a chapter, or maybe it's the end of the game, I have no idea. But either way, I can't, like, exit the game now without suffering horrible repercussions. Like having to play this game more. This is really not what I was expecting, I have to admit. Ah! Okay. No. Go away. Go away. Ow. You know what's funny? I was playing Mother 1 yesterday, and it was making a lot more sense than this. That's all I have to say. I do love that game, though. Whoa. Well, I love it mostly. It does some annoying stuff. Like, it's a lot easier to get lost than it is in Earthbound. In fact, I don't recall if I ever got lost in Earthbound. It was really fairly straightforward. So long, we have killers. Is that like Sonic or Pokemon music or something? That sounded familiar. Stealing so much music from so many games, I can't quite keep up. Good work, Luna. Can I go home now? Sure, thanks for the help. Whaling is done. Oh, so there are only four whaling ships in the whole world. Huh. Glad. Glad to help. Bye bye, smiley face. Rainbow portal! With two gray pixels at the top left for no apparent reason. What? Luna's memories of minor details. There's more! Oh, you still haven't taken your anti-twitching medication? Dude, Luna, you have to take that. I mean, Celestia. You have to take that. We discussed this. There you are, Luna. I was so worried about you. Celestia, you'll never guess where I've been. Why is that a question? That's just a statement. I was on an adventure helping this Paul Watson guy stop Japanese whaling ships. That's nice. <laughs> you can tell me all about it tomorrow. But now you must get some rest, Luna. I was gone for like 20 minutes. Good night, big sister. Take your frickin' anti-twitch medication. Did I just jump and like fall asleep? Do I have like gills? Is that what's going on here? I think Luna just grew some gills and she started breathing through them heavily because she fell asleep. I don't know. Good night, little sister. Sweet dreams. There's no way he didn't notice that twitch when he used that sprite. Spooky music! As Luna drifted off to sleep, she began to recall some minor details of her past. Some of them were not so nice. Is that the Spirit Temple music? Mia. Who's Mia? Princess Luna! Guardian of the Moon, I need your help. What do you want exactly? Aside from better fashion sense. Just come here and drink this potion. This chick seems legit. Don't worry won't turn you into a beast! 
Get ready. Fighting game? Oh. I just have to go and eat it. Ugh. Ugh. I turned invisible. Oh. It is the potion to magically transform me and turn me around. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, wait. What were you again? Ha ha! At last! Nightmare Moon has awakened! Now listen, Nightmare Moon. I need the real world dark until our pip pip is ready. Do not let Paige or any of her loser friends get in your way, understood? It's supposed to be some reference to some show I have no idea about. But we are Nightmare Moon. Do we still shoot Islamic crescents? Out of our horn? What? What? I just did what? Okay. Let's try not getting the... I'm pressing enter. Excuse you, I'm pressing enter. Okay, it doesn't accept input from me anymore. Um... Oops. What did I even do? Um... So the game stopped doing things. I'm gonna call that the end because it apparently does end there.